my story hmm? all right way to go thanks now's the part where I have to go over it like 100 times to make sure it's foolproof but for now I'm ready to hit the town all right then see you later um something wrong it's just I'm ready to hit the town you know go out yeah hope you have fun <clears throat> You said you were going to join me once I finished my story, remember? That's the whole reason I'm here. Huh? I... Oh, oh, right. Uh, sorry, I completely forgot. <laughs> Yay! So, what do you want to do for fun? I know I'd mentioned going out, but... What if today we just stayed in and watched a movie? We can get pizza! <laughs> Caitlin, you know I'm all for movie and pizza night more than anyone, but... Maybe not so much this time. Alright, then how about book night? We can stay in and do that. Caitlin, I just got done writing a story. I don't really want to delve into the books again. Not that I mind, but I think I've had enough reading for this week. Oh, well then how about we do some yoga here at home and- Caitlin. Yeah. I know you enjoy staying home, but don't you think that's a little boring? Well, t sometimes it is, but think about it this way. It's much more fun to do activities with your friends at home where everyone's comfortable than outside where you have to get all prettied up, make sure you got everything in your purse, and- Yeah, I know, it's a lot of effort to go out. But wouldn't it be nice to just go out on the town? Just you and I? Hmm. Well, if you really want to go out that badly, I suppose we can go to the movies. Ugh. No, Caitlin. That's just like watching a movie here at home, but in public. Well, you just said you wanted to go out on the town, so there's our solution. That's just the same thing we can do at the house! Well, then what do you suggest we do? I don't know, something not boring? Movies aren't boring! Uh, you can only watch Netflix so many times, Caitlin! You take that back! Never! No wonder you don't appreciate Netflix, because you have no chill! I am chill! <sighs> F, I'm sorry I raised my voice. It's just I don't see what the big deal is with going out. I'm sorry I raised my voice too, Caitlin. It's just... <sighs> What's wrong? What's... Happened to us, Caitlin? Well, we got riled up because we kind of got in an argument, but. No, not that, Caitlin. Have you ever just stopped and thought, Am I boring? What? No, why would I ask myself that? I mean, Caitlin, I know we have fun in our own way, and that's awesome. But sometimes, don't you ever just want to break the mold? I mean, look at the guys! <laughs> you catch me again, brother! I'll catch you again! La 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 Oh, you get back here, Torrent! Oh, this is so much fun! <laughs> Oh, you are doing such a good job, Travis! Oh, I can't wait to see what this turns out into! Oh, man, this is so much fun! <laughs> see? Can't you hear how much fun they're having? I can't really hear them. I can, and I hear them having a fun time! For all we know, they could be trying to kill each other. No, they're having fun! And that's the kind of fun I want to have. That's it, Zane! This is a great motivation to get I'll you to run! I'll murder ISIS, Doris! Just wait <laughs> until I get I'm my so hands on you! I have had enough to do with, with this you making me live work. right! Oh, you're well, you know what I'm gonna do? Ah! Dante, I mixed the potions wrong! Put it out! Put it out! See? 
that kind of fun. You mean the running around like idiots, oblivious to the world kind of fun? Yes, exactly! No thanks, I'm gonna pass. Oh, come on, Caitlin. When's the last time you just let loose and had stupid fun? Uh, this week, actually. Really? And you didn't invite me? It was more of a solo thing. What was it? I managed to read a chapter of my book. Uh... Well, upside down. <laughs> I'll admit it was really hard and I had to take breaks to make sure I was safe, but still. Well, that does sound exciting. I think I'd like to do something non-book related. Again, F, I'd love to, but it's too much work. Is it because you can't do it? What? I mean, I remember back in high school, you were so outgoing with social events. But maybe, since you've gotten older, you just lost your spark. No! I mean, I'll admit, I too like to stay in. But at least I make an effort to have fun and let loose. I can understand if you can't do it anymore. Oh, ho, ho, hold on there, missy. I know what you're trying to do and it ain't gonna work. I'm not trying to do anything. I'm just saying that I can probably do more exciting things than you ever could. I can have stupid fun too. Oh yeah? Yeah, more so than you. Then it's a challenge? It's a challenge. Starting now? Starting now, what are the rules? <laughs> we go out and do everything we can. If something exciting is offered to us, we accept it. No's aren't allowed, unless it's a bad request, of course. Person who can have the most fun by the end of the day gets to decide what we do for fun for a whole month. Deal. Fine. I'm going to start by making a snowman. Not if I can make one first. Mine's better than yours! Mine is more fun! Besides! Ah! <laughs> Snowball fight! Are you crazy? I'm not gonna- <laughs> It looks like I'll be the one having the most fun today! Oh. Oh. <laughs> In your dreams! Yeah! You're not ready for this one. Snowball Hadouken! Man, that was fun. Uh, but now I gotta go pick up some cupcakes. Cupcakes? Zane. What? That sounds like fun, and he's making it sound like a chore. It's a chore for me. Sounds like fun, eh? <gasps> Travis, let me go get those cupcakes for you. No, me. Ladies, ladies, please. There's enough of me to go around. Uh, we're not interested in you. We're interested in getting those cupcakes. It's fun, right? Not really. Are you kidding me? That cupcake shop is amazing! It's right inside the mall, just east of the food court, and you can't miss it! It's pink and cute and... <clears throat> Sorry, I mean, it's a real drag. Let me go get those cupcakes for you, Travis. No, me! Well, if this will get me other responsibility... All right, just go to the cupcake store and ask for the order for Travis, number 1337. On it! Not if I get there first! Jeez, those two seem to be in a peppy mood. I'm glad to see them having fun. Mm, I'm, I'm jealous they get to get the cupcakes. Ha <laughs> ha! Much faster than you, Potato! So we're resorting to pet names now, are we, Blueberry? D hey! <laughs> I made it first! Are you blind? I clearly made it first. Yeah, but I made it inside the store first. <laughs> that doesn't count. Please, can't you make those cupcakes any faster? 
the wedding is in three hours. I'm sorry, ma'am, but this is a sudden request. I know you're paying more for the rush, but we can only bake cupcakes as fast as they can bake. You don't understand. This is my daughter's wedding, and our wedding planner has completely messed up everything. The food was wrong and had to be reordered. The dresses were not what she had showed us. <laughs> Even worse is that my sister's daughters called out of the wedding. She hasn't seen them in forever and was completely looking forward to seeing them again. <laughs> oh, ma'am, I am so sorry to hear that. Couldn't you just cancel the wedding for another day if so much is going wrong? No, you don't understand. My daughter trusted me with her special day and I'm ruining it. <laughs> At least her dress is perfect. But everything else is a wreck. I have to make this right. <laughs> oh, that's so sad. Zane said the cupcake shop would be fun, not depressing. But F, she's going through a crisis. You're right. We should do something. F, no. Excuse me, ma'am. Can we help you in any way? <laughs> what? We overheard your dilemma, and helping with the wedding sounds like... Don't say it. Fun! <laughs> Ladies, it's beautiful of you to offer, but unless you can... replace her cousins... That's it! Huh? huh? You can replace her cousins. Her cousins that were supposed to be her bridesmaids. She has zero idea what her cousins look like since it's been forever since we've seen them. You ladies can help me. Uh, Athmel, I don't think we should. Going to someone we don't know's wedding? I can promise you ladies it will be fun. All right, we'll do it. Yay! Perfecto. Now, we have to get you ladies in bridesmaids outfits. Hmm, where can we go? Macy's! Irene, help me. Ladies, hurry. I have to go pick up the catering and then we have to get going. Did both of you find your size? Yeah, but I don't think we have the right color. It doesn't matter. What matters is we make my daughter happy. I don't know how I feel about lying to your- Free food and cake. Well, I'm convinced. Can't argue with that. No questions here. Great. Trust me, aside from everything going wrong with catering in the family, the wedding is in a beautiful park venue. Now let's go. Gina, I'm so sorry I'm late. Mom, where have you been? The ceremony is almost about to start! Well, I had to pick up your cousins, uh... Athmau! And Katie! Oh, well good! I was getting worried for a moment that I wasn't gonna have any bridesmaids since the other ones were sick. Plus, we we're having just such a small wedding reception, so everybody counts. Oh, I'm glad you guys could make it. Oh, Mom, you're the best! Thank you for saving my wedding! <laughs> I know. Ah, the ceremony is about to start! Oh, I'm so nervous! Come on, ladies, go, go, walk! Go, go, walk! Oh, Mom, wish me good luck! Oh. Hey, baby! I think I wanna marry you! So... What were you saying about me being boring? Because I'm sure a boring person wouldn't have crashed a wedding. All right, fine. When you're in the mood, you're a blast to be around, Caitlin. <laughs> Thanks, Av, you do. Wanna participate in another person we don't know's wedding next weekend? Uh, I think we should only do this once a year. <laughs> Deal! Where are 
are those girls with my cupcakes? Yeah!